It took y'all a little while to get going tonight, but y'all was able to kind of keep, keep your focus in the, the big big, uh, big five run of eight and able to, to pull this one out. Well, we finally got to the bullpen. Yeah. Sean Harney was really good, and, uh, you know, I, he outcompeted us, and, and that's what I'm disappointed with. I didn't think our hitters competed uh, very well tonight, and Sean Harney really competed for them. And he made it tough on us. He threw some three and two breaking balls, and, and he threw his fastball in and out. And he did a nice job, but we've got to be better offensively than that. We've got to be better defensively than that. Emerson Hancock probably throws a complete game if we just make two routine plays and, and catch a strike three. And because of that, he had to throw 10, 12 extra pitches, and we've got to take him out of the game. So we've got to be better defensively. We've got to be better offensively. Uh, certainly our pitching was really good tonight with Ryan Webb and Michael Polk coming in after Emerson. Those guys were, were really good. But offensively and defensively, we weren't very good tonight. We very easily could have lost that game. Uh, Weatherman hasn't very, been very kind to Emerson uh, this year, but what, what, why is he able to be successful like he was tonight? And the weather's cold, wind's blowing, he's still able to go out to be Emerson Hancock well, despite the conditions. It's hard to hit when, when it's this cold. And then I think you saw that on both sides. You know, when your hands are cold, the bat is cold. And uh, you know the, the real feels in the 30s. I mean, I think it's 34 degrees right now, real feel, and, and it feels every bit of it. So it it is tough to hit like that, especially when guys are pitching like that. Emerson was sitting 94 all day long, and uh, was able to throw his breaking ball and change it whenever he wanted. That, that's as good as he's been this year. Anything else, coach?